What if you have one asset field in your script? You simply drag your image from the assets folder. But what if you have 100 fields or some dynamic values? You can then import them from the assets folder using a script. First, create a new folder in assets called resources. This is a very important to call it that way. Then drag in your assets to this folder. Now let's jump to the code. I have here a method that should assign all images to the sprite array. I'll type sprites, which is my array of sprites, equals resources that load all, then passing the name of the folder in resources, in my case sprites, and then specify a type, in this case type of sprite. As you can see, there is a compiling error because load all returns an array of generic objects. To fix that, at the very top, type using system.link and at the end of our line, type that cast type of sprite that to array. Great! Now when I go back to Unity and run the game, everything looks just fine. One more thing. What if I have in resources a text file with some text and I'd like to display it on the screen? No problem. In the script, I have also a method to load the text. Type here text asset message equals resources dot load and the name of your text file, in my case, message. You'll also need to cast it as a text asset at the beginning. Then just simply assign our header text. Header.text equals message.text. And that's it. Save your file, go to Unity, and run the game. Text is immediately loaded up and ready to go. You can see that if I open it and change its content, it also updates after the game restart. And that's everything I have for you today. If you have any Unity questions, be sure to ask them in the comment section and maybe I'll answer them in the next video. Also, be sure to join CocoCo Discord and subscribe to my channel. See you soon!